Hey y'all, it's Ariel and today I'm going to be showing you how to make these cute little apple pies for breakfast. These are going to be used making ingredients from the Jenny Craig grocery guide and not to worry, if your center is out of oatmeal this week, you can also make these using old fashioned oats. Now these are just substitutes to get you through until we know what's happening with Jenny Craig. You guys, let's get started. All right, y'all, so this is actually the last oatmeal that I have available, so not to panic. What we're going to do is swap it out for one-fourth cup of old-fashioned oats, and that is going to count as a starch. Not to worry, all this will be listed below the video. But what you're going to do is you're going to blend the oatmeal that you do have on high until it forms a nice, fine oat flour. Oat flour is really good for baking, and it's super easy to make yourself. We're going to add in a half a tablespoon of Splenda. Then we're gonna add in a half a tablespoon of brown sugar swerve. Y'all, I use this in everything. Then this is totally optional, but a half a tablespoon of ground nutmeg if you want it to taste like Christmas in your mouth. Then we're gonna go in with two tablespoons of sugar-free maple syrup, and it's gonna start to get a little crumbly. So what you're gonna do is add margarine. So you are able to have margarine following the grocery guide, but we're gonna have one teaspoon of melted margarine, and that is gonna help bring all these ingredients together and make our crust look something like this. Making an oatmeal pie crust is actually super easy. So you guys, transfer that over to a sprayed baking tin. This fills two portions of my six portion muffin tin. Bake it 350 for five to 10 minutes. All right, y'all, while that's cooking, we are gonna start with our topping. We need one small apple. Honey Crisp and Cosmic are the best. You're gonna dice that baby up and then add a half a tablespoon of all the ingredients we used earlier. And again, my friends, don't worry, I will have it all listed below. You're gonna give it a good mix and then put it on a stovetop medium saucepan for about 10 minutes until everything's brown. Once you take those oat cakes out of the oven, it's time for the fun part. We're gonna put in our apple filling and this is what you get, but wait. It's up to you, but I always like to add some zero sugar whipped cream. You guys, you can find this at your local grocery store, but that just brings it on home and makes me feel like I'm genuinely eating an apple pie for breakfast. But between you and me, I think you should totally do it. You guys, if you like these copycat recipes and things you can do while we're waiting to figure out what's going on with Jenny Craig, please let me know down in the comments below. I'd love if you would subscribe and guess what y'all, I will see you in tomorrow's video.